Hey, what's up, YouTube? Coming at you with the review on the Under Armour Highlight MCs. Um, so let's get into it. So here we got the box. It's an all electro prime colored box. As if you know what the electro line foams are, it's the same exact color. Um, right here. So let's get into this tag right here. So we got size 10 and a half Under Armour MC colorway is white white. MSRP is 130 on these. I had a 10 dollar off coupon, but with the tax it ended up to be 130. So I basically got the tax off, which was nice. So as we get into the shoe, we'll get into the shoe right now. So you have regular Under Armour paper, as you can see. Now we pull out the cleat here, or the shoe, whatever you want to call it. I don't give a shit. Bang, bang, right here. But first, before we get into the cleat, let me show you something on the box. Put my name in the Bring the camera up. So you can see this. Sorry about my fingers. Hold on. Set. Okay. So this is on the back of the box right here, telling you all about the Under Armour cleat, all the different forms and stuff it has on it. So we would like to go ahead and read this. Please do. It's the shoe no one thought was possible. A high top cleat that feels light. Really light. That's the clutch fit. Does. The clutch fit. That's what that does. The V56. Does that. And I have no clue what this is called. The Plama. Plansama X. Plasma, oh, plasma, stupid, I couldn't read that. So there we go, bang, bang. Bang. So now, we can also get into the cleat. So I will bring the cleat over now. I'm not going to even edit this video, I'm just going to keep it as is. So bear with me here. So bang, bang, here we do we have the cleat. I cannot see it, I'm sorry. No, you can see the top, it's alright. It's just the laces are up there. So we have the cleat right here. We have the cleat right here for you guys. So, if you take the cleat, the whole upper, which is a high upper, uh, covers around in a, what, in a silver that fades into the white, all around upper. Of the clutch fit, clutch fit all around it that will wrap to your foot. Feels like there's another skin on there, that's what they say. So that's what the clutch fit, clutch fit all around. Love the color, how the color takes from the silver from the toe box, a dull, a lightish silver, and fade right into that pure, pure cocaine white. Really, really nice touch in my opinion. The shoe would look nice if it did have an all white upper with the silver hits instead of the black hits on the front under armor sign and the back under armor sign. I think if there was a silver in the whole upper I think that would look pretty sweet too. Now let's get into the shank plates on the back. We have a hard hard hard. That's what she said shank plate that comes around the whole bag and onto the side, the medial side and the front side. It continues like that. Now, that shank plate right there is perfect. It will lock down your foot and it's nice and sturdy and it keeps that nice in there. So, there's still clutch fit in it, so it's 
not really hard as a rock, but when you're in there, it definitely feels hard as a rock. So, let's get into the tongue area, where you have the tongue that comes all the way up in the shoe. Now, the tongue, the tongue comes all the way up at the bottom, right there. We have a mesh material that comes all the way up to about right here on the shoe. As soon as we get right here, the clutch fit continues up the tongue to the top. Now these are dead stock, so you can't really see it, but in the tongue area up here it says highlighter. That's pretty nice. Inside the tongue, we do have a highlighter colored lining. Also, feature right there on the midsole of the cleat. Now the midsole of the cleat is a mostly gray to clearish color and it also comes down on to the outsole. Now there the upper is basically most of the, the sh most of the shoe and then it comes down to the upper. I mean it the midsole goes down to the outsole. I'm sorry. So, as we turn onto the outsole, you have all your cleats and is a spine looking of a foot. This is basically a foot. Why your foot would look like kind of, I guess, is what they were going for. Just like, uh, like if you look at the Kobe, for example, the Kobe 9, it's basically like, like they have a foot, like Mac Weathers. This is like the foot. And mentioning the Kobe, this totally reminds me of the Kobe 9. But it is lighter. Like, if you can go to, like, there's so just hold one of these hands in your hand, like, it, I think it is lighter. Like, crazy, crazy, crazy. So, you know what they said when you read the box. The clutch fit is a very nice material. On the back, it is, on the outsole, it is a hard, 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 like the shank plate. And that's what she said again. So, We'll go back up to the shoe. On the Under Armour hits, we have black Under Armour hits that go right there and on the back of the shoe. The laces on this shoe are all white. White, white, white. The eyelets are just put into the clutch fit. Just holes, which is nice. Because uh, sometimes I don't like big fat eyelets, especially on the cleat. Um, Get this cleat out of this one easier. Insole, if I can even see. It says 4D foam insole. Actually, I'm gonna undead stop these right now because I'm gonna be playing tonight. Football start. Football started yesterday. 